Hey everyone, this is Dara. I'm a gender therapist in Colorado and I wrote an article today that I posted on my blog. I wanted to let my YouTube subscribers be able to uh, have a chance to hear what I was thinking about today. So I thought I'd just read it to you. The title of my article is Military Ban Lifted, a Historic Boost to the Transgender Movement. So I'm just going to read it to you from my computer right now. In years to come, today's announcement by the United States Pentagon will be looked upon as one of the most historic moments of the entire transgender movement. The ripple effects of transgender individuals no longer being banned from being able to serve openly in the U.S. military are already beginning to be felt, and the waves will only continue to grow in number and size. When the Pentagon speaks, people listen. In 2011, the ban against lesbian, gay, and bisexual persons being able to serve in the military was lifted. Over the next four years, public opinion began to positively shift on the issue of gay marriage. The Supreme Court listened to this change in perspective and, in 2015, ruled that state-by-state -state bans on same-sex marriage were unconstitutional, hence legalizing gay marriage nationally. Of course, this societal shift would not have happened without decades' worth of advocacy on the part of gay, lesbian, and bisexual persons and their allies. Having an entity as impactful as the Pentagon proclaiming, these individuals are just as welcome in the military as everyone else, gave the cause a sense of legitimacy that grew exponentially over the following years and continues to do so today. Lifting the ban against transgender individuals serving in the military says to our society, you there, yeah, those of you who have a problem with people who are transgender, guess what? They're able to be just as good soldiers as anyone else. It isn't a big deal for us to make this adjustment, and I suggest you do the same. There's a long way to go when it comes to increasing the general public's awareness of what it means to be transgender. We must continue to humanize the experience of these individuals through powerful and positive demonstrations of compassion, understanding, and validation. In this vein, today's proclamation by the Pentagon gives the transgender movement a mighty fine boost in the right direction. So there you have it. That's what I was thinking about today. Um, I'm curious uh, what you all are thinking about this news and feel free to leave your comments uh, underneath the video and uh, share with me and others what's on your mind. So I'll be back again with more videos in the very near future. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.